Hello everyone, welcome back to my heavenly babies. I'm Angel and I'm back to share the second baby that I'm gonna go ahead and put on layaway. This is Talia. Talia is also a newborn size baby. She is 19 inches long and she is also over seven pounds. I think she's 7.6 pounds. Very good, floppy, squishy, squishy baby. She really is, I'll show you how floppy she is. Just like uh, Daisy, very floppy, nice silicone. She's 20 Equiflex and a slight little, um, uh, like a slacker or whatnot in it just to make her look, you know, even more squishier. She's really squishy and just beautifully painted. She also has the painted hair. Uh, she has done as a biracial. And I've done the dark hair on her, the dark wavy hair. I'll take this headband off to show you. The dark wavy hair for her, just kind of, you know, coming different different ways. There's some baby fine hair there and all of that. Just so pretty. She's got a little swirl in the back. She's got uh, painted eyebrows, rooted lashes. She's got a little mole here and a little mole in her eye. They're just little. You'll see when you get them. And then um, she's got very light blushing, also done real pristine like Daisy. She does have the umbilical scab. I did that on her. The other one doesn't have that, but she's got this beautiful light to medium skin tone for like a little Hispanic baby, but she could also be passed off as biracial. You see that beautiful vein running through her chest there. Um, all the creases are done. All of the nail beds and tips are done. The redness to the bottom of the feet there and the toes. Same thing with the hands. She has open hand on both hands. Just so pretty. She really is a pretty, pretty, pretty baby. Uh, she'll be coming like this. She's going to come in the gray theme with the onesie in the gray theme. But I wanted you guys to see her and listen to this. Lisa from Nanny's Reborn Nursery was doing that. It just sounds like real skin. And she was comparing it. You can hear it. It's like they sound like real skin. And I use the most expensive silicone paints by Fuse FX and Fuse FX sealants with silicone velvet. So they're velvety soft. They feel, anybody bought a baby through me, they said they just feel like uh, real skin. Um, Anne over at Dells in the Cradle bought a baby and she had mentioned that. She said even her dad, when he felt it, um, I did a uh, custom for her and she felt it and she said it just feels like skin and her dad said the same thing. It feels like real skin. I use a, you know, the silicone velvet with the sealant, but just the way it seals, they, they do, they feel like real skin. She is flawless like the other one, other than like her little mole and stuff. I just mean like her skin is flawless. It's just so pretty. And so beautiful. She's a gorgeous baby. So she is also 625 if you are new and just want to buy her outright. She's 625 shipped in the United States. Um, only if you want to buy her out of the United States, you got to pay the extra shipping. And I can't ship to every country, but um, just makes me a little bit nervous. So I'm trying to keep it mostly within the United States. Um, but she's 625 if you want to do the uh, payment plan. She's $125 down, non-refundable to reserve her. Um, and that is only PayPal goods and services. All right. Um, if you buy her outright, I take PayPal or Cash App. Also, be goods and services through PayPal. Um, but I can do either on those. But for the payment plan, it's going to be just PayPal, and we'll set it up. Like I'm going to try to set it up uh, with a um, invoice where you can just make your payments. If I can do that, I seen somebody do that off of Reborns for me. I'm going to figure out how to do that. If I don't know how, then we'll have to just have you email me when you're ready to make payments. But I'm going to try to set it up so it's just easy for you because you can just pay the payments as you want and how you want. But anyways, it is just a 90-day, though, so it'll be 125 to hold her, which will go towards her purchase, um, and that will reserve her, and that is non-refundable. Then up through your payments, if all of a sudden you can't purchase her, I can give you back that payment, but you will lose the 125 because that was to reserve her. Uh, once she is fully paid, then it's non-refundable. The babies are non-refundable because these are budget silicones. You cannot buy a silicone fully painted, double sealed, with a huge box opening, beautifully done. People will tell you they look very authentic and all of that for only $6.25. Silicones are thousands. Even if you can find one around a thousand, it's gonna be a boo-boo baby and have a lot of things wrong with it. Um, but yeah, even these budget ones I've seen on Etsy and eBay and they are charging like seven to a thousand, you guys, and they're not even painted. They're just buying it, adding a little bit of rooted lashes, little few little things with it and they're asking for, you know, 700 to a thousand for it. And I'm, you know, I'm not doing that. I want to offer a great, um, let me get this light on here. I don't know why I didn't have the light. Sorry, guys. Um, but I want to offer budget babies for you guys. I'm not making nothing right now. It takes money to make money. I explained in the other video. It does. It really does. Because of all the stuff you have to buy. I mean, I had to buy her. Like each baby, you have to buy the baby. You have to buy, you know, the supplies. I'm always getting that seal because I double seal the babies. I can sell maybe eight babies and I got to buy more. It's $400 for my seal, you guys. And I'm taking babies in too. So I'm not just doing my own. I take babies in. If you have silicones you want painted, sealed, or just sealed, 
um, I do that. So um, you can contact me for that. But yeah, I, I, after eight babies, if even that, because sometimes I have to do a third one if it's not taking the seal, I have to try again because some babies, um, you know, don't want to take in certain areas and stuff. And so I always attempt a third time and usually works out. So that's good. Uh, but it does take a lot from that, that, you know, I'm just using very expensive because I want you guys to get a good baby that lasts. Everybody will tell you that bought babies. I've been doing the business for a little over a year and I've been silicone painting for over three years and um, I've sold over 50 babies since I started the business. And everybody who has bought a baby will tell you the baby's still perfect. I still stay in contact with many of the people who bought it. Josie from Josie's Jungle Room just recently did a video on her Cheyenne um, baby that she bought through me. I can't remember what she named it. Uh, maybe if I think of it, I'll stick it up on the screen here. But she bought that one. Um, uh, Anne bought one. Uh, people bought them, you know, while, a while back and said, oh, yeah, they're still perfect. No shiny spots, no nothing. So um, I just take really, you know, really good pride in it. Now, they're not concrete. They're not going to last forever. If you're rush, rough on it and stuff like that and everything, I'm sure it probably could lose some of it. But these are adult dolls. They're not supposed to be played with and be rough house with, you know, for little kids to have them. They are adult babies for therapeutic reasons, for collectors, whatever you want. But they're realistic looking babies. And so, yeah, they just, you know, care for the baby. and You're not going to have any problems where if you get thousands dollar baby, you got to already within, you know, I mean, D over at the patch, just recently got a baby and already has to send it to me to be sealed. It's already peeling. And it was a very, you know, very expensive baby. So I'm just telling you, I'm not trying to cut any uh, buddy down or anything. That's not my reasoning here. Um, everybody's just got a different way that they do it. But I want to offer a baby that's going to last at a budget price. So, yeah. So, um, like I said, Talia here is uh, 625 if you want to just buy her outright. If you want to do the payment plan, 125 down, um, only PayPal. Uh, goods and services and then that'll reserve her and then you make your payments if you are unable to do it in that 90 days um then you know you'll be reimbursed but um not once you get to your last payment though once you get to your last payment that's it even if you know if, you, if we're at the last month and the last few weeks there um and you know you just come in and then just say i can't do it or whatever well then i'm sorry you do lose the payment for that because i waited so long for it then you know, 90 days is a long time, but up through like if it's like a month in or whatever and you're not able to do it, I can give you back that money. But I keep the 125 because I reserved her and I have to start over. So I hope you guys understand that. Um, and once purchase is complete, then that's it. It's, you know, non-refundable, that non-refundable baby. And I will get it shipped out as soon as I can. Um, but she's just she is she's stunning. And ethnic babies are very loved and hard to get. So definitely uh, get your hands on little Talia here. You'll love her. I hope I can find a good home. This time of the year is just hard, I guess, to sell babies because of all the doll shows and um, kids getting out of school, college graduation, and, um, you know, going on vacations and all that. So it's just a little harder to purchase babies. Um, that's why I was having to let go a lot out of my collection at prices people could afford. I lost money on all those, but I had to have some form of income coming in. This is my income. This is how I make money. It's a hard business to be in. I can tell you that I'm learning that now because I've only been in a year. I knew the first year during the summertime it wouldn't sell because I was new. People had to get to know me. Um, and so I did, feel, you know, sell a few babies, but then just so good through the fall and Christmas. I mean, that's when they all went. I've sold over 50 in less than, you know, a little over a year. Um, and that was the ones I painted to sell. And then I've sold ones out of my collection as well that I painted and, you know, they were mine and I sold them. Um, but anyways, so, uh, and then just all of a sudden it, it's kind of died down from like the end of March to April. And I, all these artists are telling me this is all normal. Everybody's having a hard time with them, you know, with sales and stuff down because of what's going on. But I want to offer a payment plan that way somebody can grab a hold of this beautiful little ethnic baby. She will come like this with the gray theme for her, the little gray socks and the gray mitts. And she will have the gray headband, a gray hat on her, um, on her face or a diaper over her face to protect her. She will have the diaper on here. Of course, the onesie will be down. I just thought she's cute just so you can see that umbilical scab on her, um, the, you know, illusion of that. Um, and I'm going to show you all that stuff. So if you're interested, go ahead and get a hold of me. I want to put my email up there. And here's what she's coming with. The diaper she has on, an extra diaper here. They're brand new diapers. She does keep, you know, put away. Here is her box that she sits in. So everybody knows this one's hers that she sits in. So that you guys know that, um, you know, they're being protected. They're not babies that keep out, you know, just for looks. I know some people do kind of, babies they're selling will keep them out. And they'll advertise them a lot on the channel. Maybe bring them out for outings and stuff. I don't do that. I want you to get a brand new baby that I painted and it's been put away other than just making a video. All right, so the diaper, the gray hat. She will also have a diaper for her face. Unless I don't have one, that'll just be the hat. Um, here is her nook. And Passy here, and I'm just going to show you quick. I didn't in the other one. It's a lubricant, KY, um, water base only. You just want to do a little bit on the nipple of the 
uh, pacifier or the bottle. And then I did open her mouth, so just squeeze her little cheeks and just put a little bit into her mouth and then it just slides in so much easier. Now this is a little bit of a softer pacifier, so I might give her a different one, but it does go in. It's just that it takes just a little bit more to push in, but just be gentle. But there it is, so you see it does go into her mouth there. That's the passy and um, clip she'll come with. Like I said, it went in, it just takes a little bit longer. Some are a little bit stronger. That's a little bit of a softer pacifier, so just be careful, but it goes in. It doesn't ruin her as long as you have that lubricant on it. So invest that. You can even get the generic version, but it has to be water-based. All right, so she'll have that. And then she will have the Cookie Monster uh, teether, the bow. In her head, I already said that, I think. The um, diaper, I mean, bottle here that's brand new, but it will be a fake formula feeding. I like to send that too. That's another thing I do for you guys. And I seal it with silicone in the end so it'll never leak or anything. She isn't a drinking wet, but you can have fun. It looks like formula. It's just lotion, water, and food coloring. But I also use that really good um, silicone, Fuse FX, I put in the end of the nipple Quite, quite a little ways up. So you can also use it for your reborns. Uh, vinyl babies, you can just bend the nipple like that and feed them too, just for fun or whatever. But she'll have this one. It's got the balloons and the giraffe and everything on it. It's cute. She'll have that one. So you know it's brand new. Baby wipes for her as well. Uh, she also gets a bib. This one's gray and pink. Kind of matches because she has that. Here's her cloth diaper. And that's the last of my cloth diapers. Um, she will get a towel as well. I, when I was showing her videos before, I didn't have a towel for her yet, but I found one. So a towel, two of the washcloths there. She also will get this um, little um, thing you can zip her into. It says Dream Big Little One. It's yellow. The sleeves are sleeveless there, but you can zip her into it. That's fun. That came out of my collection along with the bib and the um, diaper cover, but she'll have that. If she will have baby powder like the other one, again, she don't have to be powdered. You can just put it in the diaper or pound some on her for, just for the smell if you like it. Um, and then, of course, body wash for her. Set that right there. Try not to get this in over her um how come you didn't have your lovey that should have been the first thing we read out her little lamb she'll have her lamb with her that's brand new she gets the lamb the other one's got the little chick little duck she gets this day outfit the donut one isn't that cute you guys i love this one i keep raving how much i love the donut one for her and i love her day outfit i also am going to send a little rattle with her this is brand new it just came out of my collection it's just things you get when you order babies things come with so i'm going to send that with her and then she will also have a day outfit. And I'm going to take pictures just like I did with Daisy. In fact, I'll show you a picture right now of her in this outfit. How cute it looks with her skin tone. It's beautiful. Another cat and jack. This is her day outfit. Look at how beautiful this is. It's a dusty purple. And it's got the butterfly sleeves, long sleeves, but it is a onesie. And then she will also come with the white headband and the cute little lacy socks. But which you would have seen that photograph of her before I showed that. Or I can show it right now if I did that too quick. I don't know if I did it, which way I did it. Um, but yeah, she looks adorable with her skin tone. And then she will be wrapped in this blanket, this Disney one, the uh, little bows and uh, Minnie Mouse on it. She'll be wrapped in that and a couple other little surprises. So, you know, I just make it look really pretty if she gets shipped. And then if I meet up with somebody, then of course, um, off of Facebook market, then of course, uh, they're just their bag of stuff. And then she's in that box. That way I don't have to do all that, all that boxing up. But I enjoy what I do, I really do. So again, if you're interested in one of the babies, this is Talia at 625. Um, you can buy her outright. I'm gonna put it all on the screen there, or you could put down $125 down, non-refundable payment off of uh, PayPal, goods and services. So just get a hold of me, my email is right there. And then it, you got 90 days from there to pay it off. And I'll try, like I said, try to set it up where you can just make the payments. If not, you'll just contact me whenever you have a payment and let me know and then um, we'll, we'll, you know, set up where you can pay or whatever, or you could just go in and pay because it'll already be there where, where you would have made a payment to me. So you can also do it that way and I'll notice the payments and then contact me and let me know you made one. Of course, I'm going to see that, but you can just let me know. Um, but yeah, you'll have 90 days to pay her off. And if there's a problem within the first month or two or whatever, you're having problems, but by the third month, those payments, yeah, after that, I've got to hold on to it. If, if it hits that 90 days, I can't go over that. And then I do have to hold the money then because I was expecting then to sell her. So, you know, just in the first month or two, I could re reimburse you, but not the 125 that was to reserve her. If you understand that, I hope you guys understand all of that. And then, like I said, when you're in the third month, getting towards the end, when you're at the end, making your last payment, that's it. It's non-refundable payment. Um, and then she will be shipped out as soon as possible. Um, I will have photos at the end. I would have had it with the other baby too of the before and after of her so you can see what she looked like before and after her paint job. And then just some cute photographs of her in this outfit and just the outfit she's coming home in. All right, you guys, I love you very much. Uh, continued prayers, please, for my um, 
you know, the uh, shingles I'm dealing with, it is pretty painful. It's hurting my side, my back, and, and it's painful because of the little sores. It really is. I would have showed you a picture. I'll show you one more right now of my stomach. Um, that's what it looks like right now. And it's traveled around to the back and it's pretty painful. And once it gets to, it's kind of get to the point where I'm feeling the burning and the itching and all of that. And that's where it's going to, you know, in a, I don't know, a week or so, it's going to start to scab and all that. So it's, yeah, it's no fun. Uh, I think I got it from stress. Stress can definitely do it. And I think just with my back pain and just, you know, um, financial situations, having to let go of a lot of babies, and everything, everything I'm going through, it's just, you, you also, if you look it up, can get it from stress and also dealing with the stress of my mother when she had that stroke, that was really hard on all of us. So I think that's why I developed it. Your immune drops. And that's why I think it, it happened. If anybody was ever born with chicken pox, didn't, wasn't vaccinated in our time, um, you can get the chicken pox and then you are prone to get, uh, shingles. It isn't something you'll get forever and ever, but you can be prone to get it. And I could be prone to get it again now since I got it. Uh, so I really do got to try to relax. So I hope one of these babies do go or both of them do go. I, I mean, both, you know, a good mommy or daddy. I hope I find them for them because it's just been tough financially, really, really tough. And I'm going to try to make it easy for you guys. Um, and if the faster you can pay the payment, great for me. Uh, but I'll give you up to 90 days after that 125 is there. It'll be reserved. Then you'll see on the thing I will write reserved. So other than that, I love you guys. Everybody take care. God bless. And I will see each and every one of you in my very next upload. <music>